it is a eight two to one mixture. So for every, so I like to think of it super simple. If you have a mixing cup, it's easy, but if you don't, you know, basically measure it out. So you figure eight ounces of that for every eight ounces, you would put two ounces of reducer and one ounce of hardener. Okay, eight, two to one, that's the mixture. Sometimes it's four to one. So for every four ounces, you would put one part of hardener sometimes there's no reducer sometimes it's just you know four parts to one part so you know out of 16 ounces you would put 16 ounces of uh, your paint and then four ounces of your hardener that's four to one okay super simple to think of it that way and uh, i've never heard of the brand before just mixed it up shot it came out super glossy um, this uh, safe did have a texture on it, like an undercoating texture, so you can see that it does have a texture on it, but it came out glossy, even with the texture. Okay, so keep watching the video. We're gonna go ahead. All we did was sand it down super quickly. Uh, we didn't even really prime it. We just shot the paint right over it. And with enamels, you can get away with doing that without primer, um, especially for something like this, like filing cabinets and safes and stuff. Uh, it, you know, came out really, really nice and glossy. So keep watching the video, uh, subscribe, share, like, if you uh, like these kind of videos and we got more on the way coming uh, all the way down in here in Hawaii from Paradise Garage. Talk to you soon, bye. All right, awesome, let's get started. So here we have a safe that we're sanding down uh, with a 240 grit initially, just to kind of feather out some of the deep scratches that we had on it from moving it around and things like that. Uh, and then I took it down with the 360 grit. Okay, just got it down, uh, blew it all off. We got it nice and clean. We're going to be using the uh, Atom X 27 low volume, low pressure paint gun, which is good for somebody who has small air compressors, uh, a small air compressor setup at home. Okay, for me, I was running a little 30 gallon uh, belt drive air compressor here, and um, you know, a low volume, low pressure gun will allow you to use uh, and spray at a very good PSI, you know, 24, 25 PSI, um, and also use less volume uh, from your air compressor. Okay, so we mixed up our eight two to one mixture uh, black enamel paint that we got off of eBay here. Uh, super affordable, it's like less than a hundred bucks shipped. And uh, we're using our quick cup system and we're using the gun bud light attachment, which makes it easier for you guys painting in the home garage or just in a a tent or some sort of DIY setup, um, lighting could be a huge problem. And without proper lighting, you can't see what you're painting. You don't know how glossy it's coming out. And that's the big issue. So if you look in the front of the safe here, I did have some uh, areas where the paint wasn't sticking. It had some adhesion issues. Looks like a, a big fish eye, um, like in a line kind of going downward. And um, I'm guaranteeing that it was just, it wasn't wiped down properly. I had some. So the way to fix uh, fish eye like this or adhesion issues is to dust your base on with a lot of air. Okay, not, not base coat. Actually, this is uh, single stage. Okay, so you could see what I'm doing here. It takes a little while, but it covers. You know, you don't want to rush it because it'll just uh, separate again. Okay, so you're just putting a lot of air, mostly air, and then you're just lightly dusting it, dusting it, coating it, and coating it, and then it basically it goes away. Okay, this is a quick fix, uh, a painter's secret, so to say, but it works wonders. Um, it's different when painting base coat, clear coat, and single stage. You know, with base coat, if you're having a lot of issues like this, uh, with adhesion problems, biting or separating, you know, you can let it dry, sand it down, and then rebase it. But with single stage, you can't really let it dry and send it down, you know, because you're just, it's just going to take forever, you know, it's going to take hours to cure and then it's going to take the job into the next day. So this, what I just did was a super quick fix um, to get it uh, to fix the issue. And you can see how glossy it's laying out. We put two medium heavy coats on it uh, and it came out great, you know. Um, so yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Super simple setup here. We didn't even use any primer, you know. I mean, for something like this, it's not a, it's not going to go on a car show or anything, right? But it came out good. You know, enamel is a super thick paint. It covers just about anything. Um, and you can see here, I sprayed right over, you know, metal and some like rust, uh, some rusted areas, you know, like surface rusted areas, and it just covered it, sealed it really well. And that's our before and after. So if you want to learn more about this, check out learnautobodyandpaint.com. Grab your free 85-page auto body manual. 
Um, it's also going to come with a bunch of free trainings. And uh, I hope you hope you like it. Talk to you soon. Have a good day. Bye.